Hey guys, it's Music Clues of Media Maniacs here. Hey guys, it's Emily of the Sassy Sisters, and both of us are from the Go Gamers. Um, with us being two chance together here, and we got some serious stuff to talk about. Yes, uh, there's some very serious stuff that we need to be honest about about at this point because um, it's mainly been affecting our productivity for both channels. Um, so I figured that this would be a good time as any before the fall hits, that's before things get too hectic for both of us, uh, that we make this super, super serious video so you guys know what's been going on behind the scenes uh, with both of us. Uh, so how it's going to work is we're going to be uh, individually explain what's been happening behind the scenes with both of us lately. Um, so you can understand the situation on both of our ends. Then we will talk about stuff, stuff affecting our projects going forward for both channels. Um, and how you could possibly help, help because we might need some more help to help keep the channel afloat. Or channels, I should say, afloat. Um, and then we will end the video there. So this one's going to be a long one still, but it will be, those are the three main parts that we'll be talking about. So yeah, um, since M has the worst situation of the two of us, I'll have her go first because she has a lot to explain. Right, thank you, Ms. Clues. Um, hey guys, it's, again, um, if you don't know me, my name's Emily. I'm the leader of both the Go Gamers Network and the Sassy Sisters channel individually. Um, I've been with um, these Clues for six years, and as of last year, we decided to split into two separate channels since we have both different ideals um, going forward. But now, um, as we fast forward to today, and with COVID, um, it's about time that stress of COVID hits us and it is hitting us hard. So what's basically doing for me is thanks to work and college coming up, um, it has been very, very hard. Um, I've been trying to get back up and moving on my end after taking a long break. And as I said before, college and work coming up um, is going to be very hard. I'm trying very, very hard to financially um, make a difference for myself and my own team that I have over here already. Uh, but we still need more manpower, I feel, um, to make it happen. Um, of course, not promising anything in financial means unless support comes around from yours like you. Um, so whenever we put out these opportunities for you guys to financially support us um, or either of us, um, know that we're not doing it out of greed. We're doing it out of our own time and responsibility that we're asking, can you financially support our livelihoods? Because um, in a matter of, I want to say four years, and I hate to be this personal, but I feel it needs said, in four years time, if I don't do something, my family is going to be in the worst financial shape it's ever been. So this is pretty much a matter of life and death for me personally um and again i'm not asking out of greed i'm asking out of just for the sake of humanity over here to whenever we provide such opportunities to support me whether it's subscribing hitting the like button and so forth to just do it it doesn't cost anything other than just as a few seconds of your time to hit a like or subscribe button. Really, it doesn't. Uh, I'm looking at statistics over here, and you guys, you're not supporting me enough. You're just not. And 
getting these clues, I'm sure it's the same thing. You guys aren't taking that 30 seconds or whatever to show your support. Now on the financial side things, sure, it may cost you a, a dollar or two, but still the same thing. It only takes 30 seconds. Um, is something wrong with that? No, there's nothing wrong with financially supporting us and taking 30 seconds of your time in your day for that. Sorry for going on a rant, but yeah, college and other things are coming up here. I have long-term projects that I think you guys are going to like, but I can't do that if I don't have the support, guys. So please, I'm asking, we're both asking, support us, please. Thank you for all that explanation, Em. Yeah, so it really is a matter for life or death. Death. There's some other details, but I rather not go into those because it, it's too personal and it involves a couple other people that we've had not bring names up. So, yeah, but I will say that that is the general gist of M situation. In four years' time, she might not even be able to do YouTube anymore. More, more. So, for the sake of it, please try to support as much as you can. Can can and. That she also said she has projects in the works. She and I have talked several times about several projects she wants to work on, but she can't do yeah, that. You guys, you guys have seen the proof. You've seen the proof. Normally those videos go and listen, but bam, they're there. The proof is there. Stuff is coming, guys. It's coming. It's coming. Yes. You just got support. It's coming. Yes. Uh so it definitely is a map out of you just supporting em as much as she, much as she can it's really a very serious situation over there and it's not looking it's probably looking worse worse every other day i've talked to her honestly lee um in fact in the last couple weeks i will say say she has probably she uh, this is probably the slowest I've seen her. Uh, she's been worry worried about several projects behind the scenes. I will not say again, but uh, it it just we just need as much support as we can for the Sassy Sisters, guys. So please, if you can, I'll leave a link in the description below to the Sassy Sisters channel and go support Emma as much as she can. She's trying her hardest to get videos out for you guys, but there's several things coming up that's going to make it hard for her. Right, and then um, as we move on to your situation, Ms. Clues, you're almost the same exact way, but it's different. Yes. At least you're a little bit luckier than I am that you're not in deep a hole as I am over here emotionally and financially, but still, it is still a financial burden over there. You just uh, choose not to worry about it. Yes. Uh, so what is, uh, so um, are you done, Em, first? I want to know if there's anything else you want to say before we move on. Um, no, um, other than, um, guys, if you look at the other videos right now that I normally would have unlisted, like other YouTubers, um, all the proof is going to be there, um, and we are going to discuss it later on, but, um, there are ways that you can support us, um, internally as well, because we are looking for actual um, manpower over here on my end, um, probably both ends of, if, you know, if I let me as close and do his rambling, but yeah, uh, yeah, um, in all the ways possible, guys, um, there are plenty of ways you can support me right now. You just have to do it. It doesn't take that much of your time. Indeed. Okay. So moving on, uh, my situation, as, uh, Emily said, is not as, dire as hers hers but it still is pretty serious so um you guys i haven't talked about this at all all the only person that actually knows about this is really um ethan emily and maybe like one or two other people people outside of that but this past december my mom passed away way and it affected my whole family so it has been really hard on the whole fa fa family to move forward. We've done pretty good so far. Far things have gone back to pretty much a normal life pace, but it, it, there are times for the family, family, not me in particular, 
particular, but my sisters and some of my other family members have missed my mom, mom, and it's it it's really hard. Now the other thing is um, potentially I will possibly be moving soon, soon. So this whole setup you currently see me in, and I probably won't be in in it in the next two to three uh, two to three months months if I find an apartment to live in. The biggest issue with that, that is um, why that doesn't mean too much going forward for, forward for the channel. I mean, I'll still get videos out when I can and this stuff. During the moving process, when I do, that means I will have little to no videos to push out, which of course is already a warning in advance that when that does happen, and I will do a video on that when I am moving, moving that uh, there will be little to no videos uh, potentially potentially outside of possibly live streams maybe, but uh, outside of that, um, this is a pretty serious thing because this, uh, this means two things. One, I'll have even less of time to work on uh, vi uh, videos vi really in general and commit to long-term projects. Projects. That doesn't mean I won't be able to do any long-term projects. It just means that I'll have a lot less time since I'll have to advocate for myself a little bit more, more than I used to. It's a big step for me as an adult. Um, and the other thing is, is um, even if I don't uh, potentially, uh, potentially move, uh, move on my own, my dad is still continually moving out of where we currently live. So even if I, oh, sorry, you were wanting to say something? Yeah, um, I hate to say this to you, but um, this is kind of a shocker to you too, maybe, but um, my grandmother on my father's side recently passed away too, so. Oh, I'm sorry for your loss then, Em. Yep, yeah, so even more need for support, especially um, for my dad because of his health. But yeah. this is why I said, you know, in four years time, even maybe sooner, depending, we may have brought bomb over here. Yep. If I don't move. Uh, yep. Um, but yeah, so continuing on, it, it it's just going to be a hard times for me. Now, that's not to say it's going to be all doom and gloom. I don't plan to really commit serious move moving until after after this until after or during December because I want to get through these next next three months of games before I focus on anything super serious but um this does mean that coming eventually probably in 2022 if I do find one in between that time I will probably possibly be moving that doesn't mean I will be will be right away but potentially I am mo moving sometime soon in the future future this is a big step for the whole fam family family because I've lived in this place my whole life but it is a big step forward forward uh now I don't want to talk about what Ethan plans to do in the future because that is something that he and I have talked about and decided to keep private for the sake of the channel uh so nothing with Ethan is going to change uh we'll still keep in contact we'll still do videos together we've always done that done that we've been best friends for life so it's it's that's not going to change but for me going forward there's some very serious stuff coming coming uh, probably in december at most likely likely but i just wanted to let you guys know that that is a pretty serious situation it's not as bad as m situation but it is still pretty serious uh so if i'm not active uh, I'm not as active on Twitter or other social media than I usually am. That probably means I'm either busy or working on videos, like I always am, or I'm just thinking about my future. Future. So if I don't respond right away, I apologize. But yeah, a patience would be appreciated. Right, and now um, I think uh, we already. It's already was a pre, you know, already um, a thing that was shown um, over on my end. I don't know if you plan to on your end anytime soon over on um, our sister channel, Me and Maniacs, which is, of course, your channel means clothes that you're doing for us both here, the Go Gamers. But um, 
if you are over on my channel, as I will mention again, um, the proof is there about the long-term projects. Um, it's just that, um, as Muse Clue said, he cannot commit. Um, he has been helping me in the past a, a little bit, but um, as he's prepping for this move, um, he is kind of wailing away at his time more towards that and just trying to really get ahead of the game, kind of like I'm doing, and urging you guys to please helping me help me with so I can get out of my game and get ahead. Because I'm um, really, I'm out of options. He's out of options. We're stuck where we are thanks to COVID. COVID has really struck us again, guys. Like this is super serious. Yes, this is very serious. Ser serious serious as well now that's not to say, say i i uh, both of us will be completely out out of the two of us i would dare say that we both need, need the support but n needs it most most because if she doesn't if things don't change for her she'll have to for sure eventually eventually, eventually even sell her pc possibly possibly just to and this is her only way to record by the way guys so if that happens M's not going to be able to do anything related to YouTube pretty much forever, ever at that point. She'll still be able to interact with us, but she'll be out of the YouTube game completely in terms of that. That And I really don't want that to happen. So she just needs as much support as she can. As for me, on the other hand, I am just as lucky to still have a working job, but I still will need a little bit of support going forward, forward because if I do end up moving out, out of my state, then I will need to search for a new job, job eventually. So it would do me an honor if you liked and subscribed as much as you could. Could I'll still find financial ways to get myself supported. No worries. Worries. My dad's not going to completely drop me out of blue like that. But um, at the same time, though, it will be a lot harder. harder. So yes, please support both of us as much as we can because uh, we're pretty much out of options. We're still the Go Gamers in terms of the name but i feel like we're all in terms of the go gamers in general or just the go gamers network now more so than the go Na gamers under just one channel branch because we as m said earlier we both have different philosophies and different ways we want to go and as for the long-term projects don't get me wrong i am still working with them as much as i can to get the projects done but as i'm prepping for what is my future in general General, that is taking top priority. This is a super serious thing, thing that I've thought about for the last maybe two to three years, but I haven't taken it seriously, this seriously until my mom passed away. So this is a very serious th thing, thing for me to think about and I would appreciate all that. So, yeah. So I guess we should probably move on to how you can support us both in the future. I'll let M go first again of how you can support the Sassy Sisters as a whole. Right, so for both of us, um, I'll just get set first. Um, for both of us, what we plan to do, um, we know it's not um, solid financial support, but we do plan to set up a business PayPal that everyone can tip into. You know, we're going to have our own little tip page, we're going to have our own little membership things and everything. All the little bells and whistles that you guys love, love, love so much. Um, if you want to support us that way. Um, but as we keep saying, you know, like and subscribe, really. I guess if you can't financially support us, because the statistics are there, guys. Like, like don't lie to us when you say you're subscribed. We can see who's subscribed and who isn't. We can see you. We can see you. Yes. Yes, we can. We can. We can. I mean, there's a reason why they show the statistics about who's subscribed and who's not with all the popular YouTubers out there. Yeah, am I correct? So yeah, and I can definitely see see the artistics for each video as well of who watches my videos, videos that are subscribed to me and who isn't. So I would definitely say, say we can see it. But yeah, uh, sorry to interrupt there. Right, so um, we're not gonna branch out to any other networks other than 
possibly me um, retrying my official verified livid account, which by the way, I will be live streaming there sometime soon if I get the settings right. Um, hop on over there if you want a full experience because I'm sure, unlike YouTube, there's no copyright yammerama going on. <laughs> I plan to do Ring Fit. I plan to do a whole bunch of games and everything. Only, you know, it's, of course, if you want, uh, like, extra bells and wish whistles like the dubs, then YouTube is more your thing. But if you want, like, music and everything, like I will for Ring Fit over on Libit, then, yeah, go over there whenever I uh, um, announce that over on my Twitter page. Um, but other than that, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, tipping, we're going to rely on tips and stuff. Yep, that's pretty much it. Uh, so as for me, me, um, what is just appreciated is that you guys just like and subscribe the heck out of the channel. Channel, I mean, you guys have been doing that anyway. So our, uh, our sub count has been going up, up at least every other day. Day I've noticed. So you guys are doing a great job of doing that. Doing that now. We uh, now, uh, as you guys know, I can't do it until I reach one thousand subscribe. I was in terms of monetization. So right now, out of the two channels, this Ask Sisters is the only one that can actually do such a thing. Uh, but if I am able to ever, if we do set up that tip PayPal, uh, when we do live streams, I will set up a place where you guys can tip us, tip us so we, you can support us that way. But for the time being, being outside of that, uh, that, that is just pretty much it. Of course, as always, dual mixes will not be, uh, obviously we have any monetization since I don't technically own the content when I do that, but, uh, all gameplay videos, uh, discussion videos all that will be monetized for money's sake because uh yeah uh i could get in legal trouble by both the artists and many other people if i do do monetize by dual mixes so that will not happen but anything else in terms of content will be obviously doing that right oh and also to any of you got new newbies like us who are out there hopefully you don't fall into this hole also if anything, go out there with your best shot and just try. Like, that's what we're doing right now. We're just trying. So, newer YouTubers, we're in the same boat as you. We're, we're, we're um, coming out of retirement here. We're trying to get back into the swing of things. But, yeah, we're, we're ready. We just need to, um, yeah, just all we're asking is to support guys. I mean, our hard work and everything is there. We're just looking for um, support from you guys at this point. Yes. Uh, so let's talk about how you can do it together. Of course, uh, I won't open it right now for my end, but Emily does did mention manpower. So uh, we will open hopefully soon some, maybe some sort of application or something for the Sassy Sisters, because why Emily? Emily and I are busy working on some long-term projects. We will need someone to continue to steadily give content out to the channel, to uh, her channel in particular, because it's pretty much uh, dead at this point. Right, right. Right now, pretty much where I'm basing everything off is a casting call club. Um, and I believe um, if you Google casting call club, um, into your Google search address bar, whatever, um, you can go in there and yeah, I'm in there. So if you happen to see my profile in Casting Call Club, which I know it's one of those uh, sites that is one of those diamonds in rough, I, I know, in fact, let me turn my partner off so it's better for me. Um, yeah, it's one of those diamond in rough sites, but that's where I'm basing talent apps right now is casting casting call club if you want to go there again if you search out and google casting call club that's where it is i try to feature my projects whenever one does go out so i am in the open guys right now i am in the open i am ready to for you to come into my arms right now 
sure you might not get paid right away, but that's only because, as I keep saying, and as some news clues keep saying, we need financial support in order to do that. Okay, so we cannot guarantee financial support for anyone else that opts on. Everything is volunteer support if you tr do it, want to do that right now, or at least most of the things. If you absolutely need paid, we'll try, but we can't promise it, okay? Capiche, capiche, okay? So that's all I got to say on that because I don't need people getting angrily typing in the comments. Yes, uh, that, is, that, that is very serious. Um, uh, so yes, that is one way you could support, uh, support us for sure. So I will be opening applications right now because me and Ethan have pretty much survived five together in terms of content, content, but I will probably open applications at one point and I'll leave, leave information about that in a separate video from this one, one later on. But yes, if you please, I'll leave a link in the description below to M's casting call page page and you can check that out out we uh where you can definitely contact her because right now she really needs as much help as she can uh the two of us like i said like she said i'm pretty much carrying us both both and even then that really shouldn't be the case case we both should be getting more, more content out as much as we can especially because these long-term projects are going to take a while and since i can't make any too, uh too big of a commitment right now uh, since I have my own channel and so much else in life to juggle, uh, some more help on M's and would be appreciative for both of us. I honestly would be, it would honestly be nice. Uh, but um, uh, do you have, speaking of which, do you have any criteria for that, M, for joining real quick? Um, yeah, right now, um, I'm going to, as of recording this video, update for you guys i didn't post it yet um but um right now as this video goes up um there should be another video that should be up right now that's for writers so if you want to say work on your attention to detail get into writing um transcribing etc like i have a casting call open for that right now um, at least, or at least by the time that this video is up, um, there should be casting call for writers. Uh, one of the rank positions is paid, uh, but the rest aren't um, because of, again, financial reasons. We need that financial support. I won't repeat myself one more time on that, but yeah, we, I am uh, casting on a pretty limited basis right now, just so I'm careful. Yes, 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 yes. Um, okay, okay, thank you for that, Ed M. I'll also, when that is up, I'll also leave a link in the description below so you guys can also check that out as well. well uh, oh, and by the way, I should probably mention this This writing is for our Metopia, uh, for the Metopia project M is currently working on, on just so you know. No, we are making some progress on that, but the video that we made will explain more details about that, that for sure, so I don't need to go in detail here, uh, but yeah, please check that one out as well. It would really be a piece. Oh, and also, guys, also, if this piques your interest, if you do good enough at this writing job, I might keep you. I might keep you. Let that be lesson. I might keep you. Yes. Yeah, so uh, if you plan to do more jobs after Metopia, so I might keep you. You never know. Please do a good job, and maybe, maybe not. I will keep you. You'll have to see. I'll have to see. This is a two-way street. I'm honest. I'm fair. I will help you. I, if you help me, I'll help you. That's how it's going to go. Indeed, indeed, indeed. Uh, now, in terms of joining uh, the Sassy Sisters channel, is there any criteria that the fan, that the people who are interested in joining should know? Um, yeah, please. Um, if you're going to be filming for us, have a good capture card. Um, Elgato, I know if you're someone who doesn't want to hook up to a TV um, and just wants to hook up directly to your PC, Elgato is not a good way to go. Get the other media. That's a nicer one. Um, we would buy it for you, but we can't. 
So we're not like the fancy YouTubers who can do that for you right away. No, we can't do that. You have to work that off yourself, honey. No, thank you. Um, not to be rude, but we just can't do that. Also, make sure that you're up to snuff on your PC specs if you're going to do anything else. Uh, really, I'm really lax. Um, just if you're a novice for whatever reason, if you're just starting out, uh, just be good enough that what you're going to try to do, because I need um, emoji makers. I need uh, people that can do thumbnails, which I know musicals can do, but he kind of can't right now. Um, yeah, basically, I'm looking for a full-fledged scene, guys. So, yeah, Dallin, bring it on, bring it on. Come talk to me. Indeed, bring it on. Indeed, indeed. Indeed. I will also ask that um, if possible to help uh, help out clicks, if you have any of the next gen consoles, that would really do a boost in the ratings for M because uh, you probably haven't noticed this guys, but some of my most popular videos on the Media Maniacs here are on next gen comparisons. They've gotten a lot of clicks. So that would really be appreciated if you have one of the next gen consoles that if you All could. Right. All right. Hey, please close. Um, can you keep talking? I got me myself for a moment. Yeah, go right ahead. Okay. Okay. Uh, let me just uh unshare screen real quick, quick for a second, second, so you I can focus on me. Okay, guys. So um, yeah, one of the things things that we need to uh that uh we need. M needs for sure is people who can help long term commit to the channel in terms of getting more content out. So some of the things I would recommend if you want to impress M is if you have one of the next gen consoles, like I said, so either the Xbox Series S or X like I, I do, or the PlayStation 5 like Ethan does, that would really be appreciated content wise, wise, because as I said, next gen stuff has gotten clicks lately. So definitely that another thing is if you are PC novice, just like M said, be good enough that we can. Uh, we can't, or we won't take anything that's below 25 play minutes per second, second, unless it's 2D game. Game, I'm mainly talking about this for 3D stuff. Stuff, most 2D games will not run on a potato PC, most. Uh, but for some 3D, uh, for most 3D games, you will need a good enough PC that it won't chug, chug when you do both your recording and that. So if you do, do have that kind of PC, I would recommend try to find upgrades. I know that's hard at the moment. Uh, but uh, if you could try to do that, that would be great. Um, another thing, thing I would recommend uh, for thumbnail makers is if you use some kind of thumbnail maker, set an example to M, M or if I'm hiring me, so I can see see what uh, so we can see what you can do in terms of thumbnails. Because one of the things that does help out YouTube is thumbnails for videos. Videos. Some people do in-game thumbnails. Some people just put together thumbnails professionally. So either one is fine. So I would really appreciate it if you guys could show us what you can do and also let us know your software. I personally use Photoshop. You guys probably already know that at this point for all of my thumbnails. Uh, but for everything else, it would be really appreciated if you could just, you know, uh, let us know what other software you use, use so that way uh, we know exactly what you can and can't do. Um, video editors is a crucial one for M. Um, video editing is definitely something that we could use a lot more of. Both, I mean, I already edit most of my videos personally. Personally, so I try my hardest to get that done. Cause uh, when I record Wii U and Wii stuff, when I record Wii stuff, I usually do it for my Wii U and I have to manually crop the video. And if it's split into parts, then I gotta go into iMovie and add in transitions so that way it flows well still. So yeah. Yeah, there's that. Um, but uh yeah, that is pretty important. So also, please, please do that as well. Um, let me see. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that, guys, but yes. Hold on, hold on a second, M. Hold on a second, M. I had to unshare screen for a sec. Okay, there you go. You're back on. Okay. 
All right, sorry about that, guys. Um, as you as you probably saw, I got interrupted by my family. Um, <laughs> we are a house of five, so yeah. So excuse me. Okay, I know we don't normally share this personal kind of stuff, but I again, this is a good, 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 good organic um, update view from the both of us. Just so you know, what's up? Yeah, <laughs> uh, but yeah, so that is definitely something we should you should uh, consider. I was just telling them telling them some things that they should you they should consider letting you got uh, let uh, letting you know about like what software you use if you're a video editor or a thumbnail maker maker and stuff like that. Yeah. Oh yeah. Like um, if you're a if you're a non Mac user, like I know. Mac users, if you have iMovie or something, go ahead and use that. But if you're like uh, Windows, like I am, I like to use um, Win Wondershare Share. Bleh, I cannot say it right. Wondershare for Filmora X. Um, it's very nice. Um, it's about sixty bucks, so full price of fame, but well worth your money and your time. I use it, even though my PC doesn't like it, which is why I need a VLR, so I can avoid that, my PC crashing for crying out loud. Um, you get me, you get me, people who are potential VLRs for me out there, you probably get some stress. <laughs> yes, yes, and as a video editor myself, I also get that stress. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to upgrade my whole setup here. Like these smart lights, these are no cheap feet. No, thank you. This yeah. is just so it can look good for you guys. No. Yep. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh uh, in terms of thumbnail makers, also please let us know what you use because that is like super important so we know what the capabilities of your hardware is obviously i use photoshop like i said earlier uh but it really is important um is there anybody else that you currently need outside of a, a full team uh uh other than people that can help with vr aside from me from uh, alien right now no all right all right well i guess that is pretty much uh it in terms of how you can help us so i guess we should probably close out with a statement from both of us uh both of us from here uh for uh for this video since this was a pretty lengthy one okay we, oh. which we apologize for yeah but we won't be serious we want to be straight up we want to be direct yes uh so um m i'll let you start off the statement and then i'll finish it right so to start off, um, I'm sure as you understand, other YouTubers do not get this serious all that often. We're not the other YouTubers, guys. We're not the fancy schmancy competition over here. We're serious, we're honest, we're organic in our own way. We just love being there for you guys. We don't put a mask over our emotions or anything like that. But like, we're here, we're here. We're actually here. We're not like a million miles away from ourselves when we do something. We're actually here. Jeez. And um, yeah, when we go over the next year or so, um, I mean, it's going to be hard. Um, as you heard us say, um, we're going through quite, um, quite a hard time right now, especially with this... Uh, Delta variant for COVID, which I hate bringing up the pandemic again, but um, yeah, it's like the flu. Um, the pandemic's going to keep going on and on and on. And until uh, we can successfully move on, um, your support for us both is so desperate right now. We cannot thank you enough. If you do support us, guys, we need it. We really do need it, okay? So we cannot say enough. We cannot thank you enough if you do. Um, but if you do support us from the bottom of our hearts, thank you. Yes. Uh, and to continue and finish off that statement, uh, it has been a long journey for both me and M. M. We've known each other for six years, like she said earlier. 
Philia, and it has been a serious six-year journey up, down, and all that round, just like the song from Sonic Adventure. Uh, uh, and honestly, I can't say uh, thank you enough to all of our fans who have stuck with us thick and thin through the ups and downs that we've had with the channel, uh, channels and the chant and the original Go Gamer channel, formerly that now, uh, uh, when we were, were one channel together. But it is really appreciated that either way, way to all of our longtime subscribers who subscribe to the Media Maniacs and are still subscribed to the Sassy Sisters, thank you. Thank you for your support. It's really appreciated that no matter what, you guys have stuck with us, so it's appreciated. And then for our, our new subscribers, thank you for joining the board us. It's going to be a wild ride these next couple of years, uh, and next few years, but uh, honestly, we will try our best to make it worth every single minute, the uh, minute of a video. In fact, in fact, I'm almost close to 3K, so can, can we get there, guys? Can you please make that happen? I pray that you do. And if you if, if I do get there, future me thanks you. Definitely, definitely. <laughs> that would be nice. Uh, I'm in no rush to get to 1,000 subscribers, of course. But if you guys could uh, get to get there possibly by the end of this year, that also be appreciated. Uh, but um, yeah, so definitely. And for anybody who is interested, interested in joining the borders, like I said, said, I'm not currently looking for people right now, but M is, and she will welcome you with open arms. She needs to help as much as she can, guys. Really needs a lot of help, help, help. So please, please, please go to a casting call and talk to her. That will be appreciated. Um, and yeah, as the Go Gamers Network leaders, we both want to thank you for being such a big support, but it's really, really just been a wild ride for us. And honestly, honestly, I'm just glad that we haven't gotten to the point where we've quit yet. Like I, I've said this, said this a couple of times, times in private, but I have gone close to quitting uh, quitting once. The reason why we'll split up, I will let you know this, is because when we reached 1,000 subscribers back on the Go Gamers, which is now the Sassy Sisters channel, I lost all motivation for almost video making, uh, for all video making. In fact, I was almost this close to selling all my systems. This close. So that's the reason why we split up, or one of the reasons at least that we split up because I needed a fresh start just to start over from the, from the way beginning, just like I did back in the day, day when it was just me doing all this. But at the same time though, it's been a wild ride and I appreciate all the people who have joined the board. Ethan, I wanna thank all of you for supporting Ethan when he jumped aboard us and i want you to also thank uh m for being a wonderful reader as well she has been one of my closest person that i've been working to and even though we've had some rough patches in the beginning i'm glad to have known her all my life uh, all this time in the last six years that we've worked together so i want to thank thank her for being just a part of the journey journey that i've taken down my youtube path so thank you m and even if you're watching this later thank you too you are the best Esten, I couldn't have gone through some of my rough patches without you, so thank you. Right. Okay, so I think that's going to be it for... I'm sorry, that was my family. Can I... My ball disgust. <laughs> Again, family five. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, enough, enough silliness, but seriously though, new, new YouTubers are not out there. Or maybe you're some popular YouTuber looking down on us right now. We respect you. <laughs> as long as you respect us, okay? All right. But in all seriousness, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all the six years. We hope it's many more. We know that due to, to uh, statistics that people after um, as old as we are right now, they quit. But we're not going to quit because it's a lifeline for us, literally. I mean, um, also to consider this, guys. For probably most new YouTubers like us, this was going to be considered a hobby. 
it no longer isn't. This is no longer going to be a hobby for the both of us. It's no longer going to be a, harp, bleh, a hobby. So please consider that, that yes, we want to, this is not fun for us anymore. Um, not to say it isn't fun, it is, but we're not here to play games. We're not, we're just not. We can't play games anymore, we can't. We need, we are getting serious. We're hitting the pedal to the grindstone and we're just moving. Getting to say a bit of myself, but I will say that I, I'm probably having the most fun out of this that I have in the last five, 10 years. Years I've been a YouTuber in general, but it is getting pretty serious for the both of, both of us. In terms of being a network, it is getting very serious. In terms of me individually, I'm still having as much fun and I still consider this one of my side hobbies. I can't fully commit, like I always say, but I do think this has been the funnest time I've had. But as the network, yes, we are buckling down and getting serious. So yeah, so just know there's two totally different stances in my my uh, view. But for M, this is an all serious thing. Thing. So yes, we need to buckle down and get real serious with this. It's been a long journey for us. It continues to be be. But uh, honestly, out of all of us, please. Right. We can't do this without you. Yeah, we cannot. We, we, we can't do this without you. Yes. Without you, even in the beginning, we wouldn't be here right now. Without your support, we wouldn't be here. And as we keep saying again, probably in the future, if you don't support us, we're not going to be here. Because um, if you don't, we're going to end up like street hobos on the street, living out of tents and everything. We don't want that. Nobody wants that. Okay. So please support us hit the like button and subscribe in the bell icon so youtube algorithm knows and miss youtube herself susan knows that we need business and we want to get our positive and very good and wholesome content out there for you guys to enjoy and we hope the many more years that we're on youtube and whatever social media platform we're on that you guys will stick around indeed indeed i couldn't have said it better myself self uh and uh, honestly honestly like she said please like subscribe as much as you can so the youtube algorithm is in our favor and miss susan knows knows that we really want to continue doing this and for how many long, long years no matter how long we're on youtube on the day uh, on the day that if that ever comes that we have to leave YouTube, YouTube. I hope that's never, not in any year. I hope that we'll still around for like 10 more years or something. But if that day ever comes for either of us or both of us, that we can look back on this journey and said that this was one of the most positive things that we've had in our life and that we will never forget all the friends we made. Of course, I won't leave, we won't leave social media completely. I'm not gonna ditch it, uh, but if we ever have to quit YouTube for any reason, then I hope that I can look back on this and really reflect that I have had the most enchanting time. Of course, I hope that never comes, but seriously, thank you all. Thank you all for your support. Okay, I think we probably should close out this video now before it gets any longer. Yeah. Yeah, before um, Miss Susan herself starts yelling at us, why does I say so long? Or Lacey, you can chop it down a little bit. I don't know, Miss Susan. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see what I can do. Uh, but yeah. All right, guys, that's all for now. Now, thank you for, thank you for sticking to the end of this video. Um, and We know it's been programmed, and I know most of you have probably clicked off by right now, maybe without grimness sounds. I know most people don't like to hear all this stuff. They don't, but um, we'd rather do this than have a whole Q&A session with you guys over it. Yes, so definitely, uh, definitely thank you. If you could just take like a little time out of your day just to watch this video and spread it around to uh, your fellow fans, it would be appreciated. So 
Yeah. Also, we want to say um, thank you to everyone who is working with us internally right now. Um, I will mention a few shout out names here if you don't mind. Um, I just got to move myself over because I do want to say a few names that are working on the Metopia project right now. So let's see. Um, I, let's see. I want to mention Alien. Thank you for helping us edit. And um, let's see. Who's the other person that's been really good about this? Oh, I got fun. Oh yeah, Band Buddy, um, our na narrator from Metopia. Thank you very much. Um, also, Moon Moonwolf, um, Matthew McCrusty, uh, Ben Well Benwella, um, Mexo Keaton, um, Orca Singh, Ella, who's our newest team member by the way thank you very much for being here um austin e uh bessie maku mcgva peace dragon red dragon shoko and S skippy trina y1n all of you thank you very much for being on the metobia team so far i look forward to your work if you're watching this video Later on, I we both apologize for the long wait, but um, that again is explained in our writer's call video. Indeed, indeed, indeed. Uh, and I guess before we completely shut this out too, I should should also uh, mention some real quick shout outs. Of course, I've already made shout outs to you and Ethan, but shout outs to uh, Joshua uh, Hunter, uh, Hunter Jr., Jr., one of our longtime subscribers and fans uh for both channels by the way uh he's been with me since the real begin uh near the middle beginning of my uh you to be clear clear as music clues and i really appreciate him sticking around since then then for both of us so thank you joshua for being around and i want to thank all the other people who uh i've talked to and interacted with over the last five to six years as well well and that this has been a fun adventure venture and i appreciate all the support that you guys have given me as well so thank you so much and of course all the interviewees on uh interview crews that i've talked to as well well thank you for taking time out of your day day to uh let me pull you aside for an interview view it's really appreciated and uh i look forward to seeing more potential people join the board, board interview clues as well because i've talked to some pretty interesting peeps uh but yeah uh let's close this video out together so this is yours truly music clues of the media maniacs and this is easy emily of the sassy sisters also known as cyber queen as my other nickname that i will be coming around with sometime soon but of course that's for video on my end so but yes um thank you um <laughs> very much for sticking around again uh we apologize again yes and uh we will see you guys both on our respective channels in future videos and um yeah all right guys bye, bye.